It's Christopher Lee Peavy for Spirit Field Believer. And today we are standing at a very high elevation in the southeastern United States. And we want to offer up some prayers today for families. Families that are facing a lot of tragedy, a lot of adversity, a lot of, a lot of loved ones that are sick, a lot of loved ones that have passed. Uh, some due to COVID, some due to other reasons. But we just felt led today along the pathway here. We're on the road. Uh, we're at a great place to pray. And we thought, what better place than at such a high elevation to just lift up our prayers to the Lord for you today, uh, for your families. And so that's what, that's what we want to do. I want you to join with me right now. I won't keep you but a moment. I want you to join with me in prayer. I want you to agree with me right now. The Bible says where two or three are gathered, he says, there I'll be found in the midst of them. Any two touching and agreeing upon any one thing, he said, it shall be done. And I'm touching right now through this video and I'm agreeing with you for your loved ones, for your families. I'm agreeing with you right now for your friends, for your, your coworkers, for your neighbors, even people we don't know that we know is in the hospital, people that we don't know that that live in our communities that are facing certain situations and circumstances. We just want to lift up the name of Jesus, that signs, wonders, and miracles might follow us, those that believe, and that our prayers prayed with a sincere heart might be heard by God and answered in a day and hour that we're living in. So let's do that right now. Will you bow your head with me and let's pray? Heavenly Father, in the name of Jesus, I know that we can pray from the lowest depths or the highest heights, but right now, God, even geographically, we choose the highest heights, one of the highest elevations in the southeastern United States to pray from. Father, we pray today for your will to be done in everyone's life today. We pray for healing. We pray for prosperity. We pray for salvation. We pray for uh, deliverance today. We pray for relationships. We pray for marriages. We pray for children. We pray for mothers and fathers and husbands and wives and brothers and sisters. We pray for aunts and uncles and cousins and grandmothers and grandfathers alike. We pray for families, Lord. We pray for congregations. We pray for pastors today, Lord. We pray for ministers, evangelists, missionaries, even around the world and locally today, God. We pray for the prophets, Lord, that prophetically bring the word of God to us each and every day. We pray for apostles today, God, that are believing in signs, wonders, and miracles, that are planning bodies all over this nation and around the world to become corporate bodies of worship, to lift you up and to glorify your name, Father. For we know where you're lifted up, Lord, your praises and your glory will be poured out. And wherever your glory is, wherever your presence is, with our faith and our compassion, when they meet, signs, wonders, and miracles will take place. We declare right now, we declare your will over this land, over your people. We declare, Lord, that the lost will come in. We declare that the sick shall be healed. And we declare that everyone that should pass even in the midst of all this adversity and all this tragedy, that their souls might be saved so that they can gain heaven. Father, we love you and we thank you and we praise you right now in Jesus Christ's name and by the power of your Holy Spirit. Amen and amen. Amen. Hallelujah. I feel a divine presence of God right now just a divine presence of God. Before I go, I wanna invite you to pay close attention to our upcoming videos. We're putting together a website. We're gonna have several dates in October where Spirit Filled Believer is gonna be live, not just on video, we're gonna be live uh, in churches, in conference rooms, around the middle Georgia area, places that you, most of you that are Spirit Filled Believers uh, yourselves can come to and we're believing for a mighty move of God's Holy Spirit, even in the midst of this adversity. And you might say to me today, Brother Chris, why now? Why of all times with the way the guidelines are and the way everything's happening and people full of fear? Well, if there's not a better time I can ever imagine for the church and the body of Christ in general to stand up 
and to come forward during a time like this. So we're looking to do many services. We're looking to do many services during the month of October. In the coming weeks, I'll be uh, making an announcement about those services, about those service times and locations, and about how you can be a part of what we're doing and how you can help the gospel of Jesus Christ and the power of the Holy Spirit reach out unto every person that's willing to hear and receive. Amen. I want to thank you for taking a few minutes to join us today by clicking on this video. And until next time, I'm Christopher Lee Peavy for Spirit Filled Believer. God bless you on today.